Hello, my friends. Here I have four quarts, four pounds of strawberries. These are locally grown and I have them rinsed off. Uh, what I'm gonna make is one of my favorite uh, additives to my morning breakfast. So I'm taking these strawberries and going to cut them in half and dehydrate them. So I have four shells to my dehydrator and these four quarts will be one pound or one quart for each of the shelves or trays. When I set it on the trays, <clears throat> I set them with the cut side up. That way it won't have a tendency to stick. There you have it. One quart for one tray. We have four trays and that will hold all of the strawberries. Some of these strawberries are very large and a lot of people don't know this, but the modern strawberry is a cross between an eastern strawberry and a western strawberry. The strawberries in the east were small and very sweet. The strawberries in the west were large and were not sweet. And there's uh, a custom that people don't know where it came from, but the original uh, custom of when you give somebody a thumbs up, that came from the Native Americans when uh, they were out picking berries. Well, strawberries were the first berry to appear, and they had special ceremonies that they celebrated uh, festivals with the, for the strawberries. And when they would be out picking strawberries, and if they would find one of the strawberries that were as large as their thumbnail, they would get real excited because that was an unusually large size. And when they would find one, they would signal to their friends that were near, they would give them a thumbs up, meaning they found a very large strawberry. And that's where we get the thumbs up. So just thought that would be a little interesting fact. Here we have four pounds of strawberries, one pound on each tray. And we're going to turn this on and let it dry overnight. Here's what we have from overnight. And they're all pretty dry. And they shrink down to a very thin piece of fruit leather. That's one quart or one pound. We have one per tray. There we have four quarts and that looks like approximately two-thirds of a quart. Now what do we do with this? I'll show you what I do. This is organic Scottish oatmeal and what makes this different is it's stone ground instead of rolled or cut. And a, a bowl 
for me is about a third of a cup. And then this is about six strawberries if they were fresh. This Scottish oatmeal uh, being ground like this cooks much, much quicker than the rolled or the cut. The advantages of uh, drying your strawberries rather than fresh, um, you have long-term storage. Uh, and when these cook up, uh, you can see here that the oatmeal is tinted or colored, sort of strawberry colored. So as these uh, strawberries reconstitute, they uh, put their flavor into the oatmeal itself. So all the oatmeal is flavored, not just the berry. Thanks for watching my friends. Bye.